your picture could be your death trap. What if I told you that inside this image is a message no one was meant to see? Yes, what if a simple photo could whisper secret to someone on the other side of the world? Or silently hand over your identity while you scroll by completely unaware? And they don't need to break in through your firewalls anymore, they just need you to open a picture. Yes, that picture they have laced with invisible codes. Hackers are already breaking down doors anymore, they are slipping through the puzzles unnoticed, undetected and unstoppable. This is the new function of digital warfare, where the most dangerous file on your phone or your device might be just a picture of your cat. You've seen images, but have you really looked? Let's decode. Steganography is the practice of hiding secret information inside ordinary files, most commonly images, videos or audios. Unlike encryption, which protects the content of a message, signography hides the existence of the message itself. For example, a hacker might embed hidden text, malicious code, or even an entire file inside a photo. And to the naked eye, it looks like a normal picture. But with the right tool, that image can reveal data no one was supposed to see. It's digital invisibility. And in the wrong hands, it can be a powerful tool for spying, smuggling data, or launching undetectable attacks. We are going to show you a step-by-step -step guide on how hackers use tech hide eye tools to hide information from, from the reach of the human eye. Now, let me sound this caution. This video is for ethical and educational purpose only. It's for educational purpose only. Please, we don't mean to hack any device. We don't mean to cause any harm. So make sure you don't practice this one illegally. It is for educational purpose only. So let us learn and know how to prepare ourselves from the trick of these hackers. Now, before we start, make sure you subscribe to the page, you subscribe to our channel, hit on the notification icon so that you receive, you receive the notification whenever we upload a new video. Please subscribe. It keeps us motivated to continue with some of these educational videos. So let us go on my desktop. I am on Akali. Let's all go. Let's go to our desktop. All right, people. So we are on Akali. So let us begin this um, this very uh, comprehensive um, tutorial. So now we want to hide information in a picture, right? So um, before let us launch um, our terminal here. Let's launch a terminal. Then make sure that you always update your system. So now you can you can write it sudo apt um, to update to have the necessary update all right so you can hit on letter to, to receive the necessary update when you are done just run the sudo apt upgrade to upgrade your system make sure that you always do that because you are dealing with security systems so now do that one so i've done that already so now let me go ahead to do the tutorial now so let's go so now we are going to install we're going to install um, a tool called stack high now this stack high is a tool where hackers use to hide information from the eyes of people all right so you might think that um this is ordinary file but then inside of the file there is something that you cannot see so now let us run the sudo apt all right then you write the install the install 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 and then you see the stack hide all right now hit on enter now it, it, it will ask you of my my password that you enter your password now yes it is now installed so now this will hit on y to continue and now you have all this one distort so now this is really and um, this is um stack height now you can run the um stack height can run the stack height um, then help to to know the um uh, to know the various command that are available so now this is really the command that you're going to work with um the embed um embed command we are going to use it to embed so this command you're going to use it to embed embed so embed um dot dot or hyphen hyphen embed we are going to use it to embed data now if you want to extract is extract hyphen hyphen i um, mean extract you're going to use it to uh, so these are the commands we are going to use we are focusing on and um, how to hide information so now uh, before we do that let us get the image we want to hide so now let us get the image where we want to use it as as a cover a cover file so that we hide this um the code or we hide the information inside that image so now let us go to our browser section here now we are going to download a picture just any picture at all any picture at all so you're just going to download any picture at all to hide our information that we want to hide now let's come to our address bar then you can set them um, 
just just a picture um, just a, a picture now hit on enter you are going to um just want to download any picture at all then we just use the one as a high uh, as a two so now let's come let me go to my images and then let's see what we we get here okay so now okay now let me choose let me choose this let me choose this this one is okay so let me um i click on it and then click on save image as save as i'm going to save it i want to use this one as a as a uh, guy so now the let's let's name this i can name it as a, a bed is a bed right it's a bed so i can name it as a bed jpeg so now this is saved in our download there so we can confirm it now let's let, let's confirm that one let's confirm it now it's in our downloads go to our downloads here and then we have our our um this is the bed the bed all right so now this is just ordinary ordinary picture so now let's open it for you to know what's inside so this is how this um, picture looks very very simple picture no detection nothing there all right so now you're going to hide information right here so now let's close this one now before you hide information you are going to open to the directory where the file is so we have the image saved in the direct in this directory in the download directory so we're going to open this directory now we're going to open a line a terminal in this directory so right click here and then go to um open terminal here and then it will a terminal will open in this directory now let me increase the font size now we're going to um so we're going to create our text file so we're going to say that uh touch um and then what is the text file we want to create so let us create um uh, let's create just um let's say um trial let's a trial a trial a trial dot txt so this is the trial a uh, text file we are creating so it has created so this has created a test a test file named trial now let's check it out let's check that one so we see it has created a text file um that is named as trial now let's double click to open this one now this is where we'll be able to hide your information so if you want to have if we have a code anything you want to hide you can hide it in this um in this um text file so now let's see so uh, this is just um a trial uh, a trial something all right so now see that this is just a, a trial something so we just say something here this is try something now when you're done hit on save or save so i've saved i've saved this text file now let me close this one so i have saved this is just a test file this this is just a test file suppose this is just my message i want to give to someone all right so i've typed the message there so if it if it were to be code or secret or malicious um items you can just input the malicious things here without no one knowing now now let's come back let's come back to um let's come back to our page our here now you're going to um you're going to hide the code or the the information in the picture so to do that one you're going to use this um stack hide command the stack hide now you're going to be an embed you remember it's embed now it's hyphen hyphen it is embed okay it's embed file embed file now what file are we going to embed we're going to embed the trial the trial.txt so this is what we want to embed all right now we give a hyphen a w a dash um, um hyphen hyphen then you don't see the cover file so what will be the cover file the cover file is going to be the bed that we saved so the bed dots um i think it's jpeg right jp so this the 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 so this this is the meaning of of the this command we have we have we have typed so this is a stack a command a stack hide you use a stack hide now we are going to embed a file now we are embedding the file we only embed this file this text file we are embedding it in this um, image so this image will be the the cover file now hit on enter now you'll be asked to enter a pass phrase now this is a secret um, key you want to enter now this secret key will be asked anytime you want to extract so make sure you type any um you type your, your password well and then there wouldn't be any any form of recovery so make sure you type it carefully so now let me type let, let me type my my secret no so let me let me type it again now yes so now 
embedding trial in bed is done so now i have embedded this one into this one now let us go there to check something so now let's go to our file here so it, it, it said that it has embedded this one into this one so now let us let's delete this one for us to see so we have deleted this one so now let us open let, let's open this image file for us to see whether indeed we can find any bed any text file here so see there is nothing like there is nothing like um, any anything can be seen here is a normal a normal file without any distortion you don't see anything just a normal um bed there no distortion but by the lens of dark operators this image carries um code or carries a message that no one should know all right so now let's go and let's extract let's extract this one for us to know that indeed there is a message here now let us go back to our terminal here so we're going to extract so we're going to say that let's stack hide all right stack hide we're, what you're going to extract so just say that is extract extract now hyphen hyphen we're going to say a stack a stego file so we are extract extracting a stego file you mean that you know, embedded already so we want to extract this tag file now so what file do you want to extract so it is the it's the bed is the bed um dots gpe so now we are extracting we're extracting um this bed because we believe that there is a secret in this bed file now let's hit on enter let's hit on enter uh let's hit on enter enter you'll be asked to enter the password that you created so now let's hit on the uh, my enter now yes so root extracted data to trial file so now i have extracted this data now let's go back remember we deleted the test file we created already so let's go back and then check whether it's been extracted already so now let's go here let's go to our place now see yes this is the test file now let me open and see the message that we wrote so this is the message that we wrote this is just a, um, a trial something so this is a powerful tool where you'll be able to hide so implications of steganography malicious actors can use steganography to secretly get personal data without the victim's knowledge cyber criminals may embed malicious code within image audio or document once opened these files may execute harmful script that steal data damage systems or spy the user an unsuspecting person could unknowingly host or share files containing illegal or harmful content hidden via steganography. If it is covered, this could lead to investigations, loss of reputation, or even legal actions. Steganography techniques can lead to pass secret message in social engineering schemes or blackmail, especially if private materials is hidden in compromised content. How to avoid steganography? Only download files from trusted and verified sources. Modern security tools can detect steganography based malware by scanning anomalies or embedded content. Ensure real-time protection and automatic updates are enabled. Advanced users and organizations should monitor network traffic for suspicious activity like unexpected data transfer or communication with unusual domains. Files with steganography may have abnormal size or unexpected metadata. Use steganography tools to detect some of these traps. Examples of these tools are Steg Expose, ZSteg, Baywalk, Steg Detect, as if to let us stay safe and know that yes hackers they are really really doing a lot of things and then we can also prevent ourselves if we know some of this so don't forget to like this video subscribe so that we upload a lot of these videos a lot of this um, educational video